Hey guys, it's Jen Dozier Horder here, uh, Senior National Educator for Paul Mitchell and owner of Bombshell Salon in Ellicott City, Maryland. And we are in Manhattan today at the Takara Belmont Studios for our artist session, October 2017. So this is my eighth time taking artist session and I think every time I do it, I learn a little bit more. I get a little more confident in my craft. Um, being around such amazing hairdressers, you really get to have uh, other people's opinions and other people's input and really work really well as a team. And sometimes you don't always get that on set. You have to kind of be a big man and do it for yourself. And so it's pretty amazing that you get the confidence you need with the team around you that makes you feel good about what you're doing. So what we did today was um, I worked with Sarah, who um, is a top model here in Manhattan and is originally from North or South Dakota? North. North, North Dakota, the second safest state in the country. And she moved here to be a model in New York. So kudos to her for taking that leap. Um, she's an absolutely beautiful girl and her hair is an absolute dream to work with. So she's naturally very curly. And so we blew her out straight. We used the new Paul Mitchell Invisible Wear products to help blow that out straight so that when we went to curl it with our pin iron, which was the Paul Mitchell extra small iron, when we went to blow, um, um, we went to curl it, that curl would be nice and shiny and smooth because the first look that we did was a very polished, very um, put together afro. And then what we did with the second look was we changed the color palette completely, put her in all white, and threw in some pearls. The first look had a black and metallic finish. And so we wanted to do like that juxtaposition of hard versus soft. And so for the second look, we really went through and just finger by finger pieced out every single strand of hair and um, came up with something very soft. And thank God I had the common sense to bring someone with me um, whose name's Sydney Cher, who is a stylist at the salon in Ellicott City, Maryland. And um, fortunately, I have the common sense to really bring someone with me every time I go because I get to share that experience and sort of pass the torch that maybe next time Sydney feels confident enough to do this on her own and maybe I can be her assistant. So um, what she did was she helped me curl and she helped me pull pieces apart and she there's someone to hold your spray. And so what she also helped me do was talk me into saying no one's seeing the back clip the back out of the way and let's call it a day. So when you're photographing, one of the things that you learn on session is the back is really not going to be seen. So we did use clips. We have two Paul Mitchell Pro clips and then one kit from our straight pin studio kit. Um, it's just a big metal uh, duck clip. And then we actually used a hairnet, which you can't even see, but there's a hairnet in here that we tied around to make a makeshift headband. And then we took two pins out of our straight pin studio kit to create that band to keep that hairline down. So if you see, there's a lot of little hidden trickeries in there. There's a hairpin holding her hair back. So when you're working with this much hair, you got to do what you got to do to, to get it under control. So for artist session, uh, October 2017, we were really lucky that we got to work with someone who had such fantastic hair that even after we tortured it all day long, it still looks beautiful in the end. And we were really lucky that we had a model that after we tortured all day long, still kept a beautiful smile in the end. And um, I just want to say a huge thank you to Sarah for being my model because she was absolutely amazing to work with. And once again, October 2017's artist session was a success for us. So we can't wait to be back for the next artist session. And hopefully that's April 2018. So hopefully we'll see some of you guys there.